Okay, peeps, let me explain how to do this problem. Um, the Gallagher family spends $5,000 on their electric bill in the winter, half of which is the heat. They're considering buying this new furnace to heat by natural gas instead of electric. They'll get a 30% tax credit if they do it, but they have to pay these additional piping and labor costs for it. So let's go through these problems. If they buy this new $6,000 furnace, they'll get a 30% federal tax credit. So the cost of the furnace is not going to actually be $6,000. So $6,000 times 30% is $1,800. So they're going to save $1,800 on their taxes. So the actual cost, we have to subtract out those savings. So the actual cost of the furnace is going to only be $4,200. But they have to pay these other costs. The pipes alone, they have to pay $10 a foot for 60 feet of piping. So $10 per foot for 60 feet, just for the piping, they have to pay $600. The furnace itself, we just calculated, was $4,200, and then it says $200 for labor. So another $200 for labor, add that up. The total cost for this new furnace is actually going to be and the question is, you know, is it worth it? When would they get their money back? How much are they, how much do they actually spend now? It says up here they spend 5000 but remember only half of it's for heating. The other half is for their lights or their, or their refrigerator or their dryer or whatever else it is they use electricity for. So $5,000 spent now, but divide that by two. So they spend now to heat their home, $2,500. So then it says, the natural gas company assures the family that their heating bill will be cut in half. So if their heating bill is going to be cut in half, that's their bill. So if I take this $2,500, divide that by two, they actually are only paying $1,250. Or they would only be paying 1250 bucks if their bill got cut in half. So that would be their new bill, which means the other half would be a savings, right? So that's how you have to look at it. They would save this much every year if they bought this new system. So if they're gonna save that much every year, how long is it gonna take them to get their $5,000 investment back? So. Their $5,000 investment, saving $1,250 per year, that comes out to four years. So they'll get their money back in four years. They should definitely do it. The furnace will last 20 years. They won't do it, though, if they don't have this $5,000 $5, in the first place. All right, that's it.